Today marks seven years since the horrific Pulse nightclub shooting in Orlando. A gunman shot and killed 49 people and injured 53 others in the early morning hours of June 12, 2016. It's in Tampa Bay's Megan Myers live for us in studio this morning with more on how people are reflecting today. Good morning, Megan. Well, hey, good morning. At the time, the Pulse nightclub shooting was the deadliest mass shooting in U.S. history. Governor DeSantis has ordered flags to be flown at half staff today at all state and local buildings. He says this is a way to show respect for the victims and their families. Crisis Center of Tampa Bay staff say that today is a day where a lot of people could experience triggers. People living in the Orlando area, here in Tampa Bay, people from all over. And they want the community to know that they're there if help is needed. It's so important for each and every one of us who were impacted by the events at Pulse Nightclub to make sure we're talking about it to our family members and our friends. If we don't feel like we can do that for whatever reason, please know that you can call the Crisis Center by calling 211 to get that help and support. Now over in Orlando, the Orange County Regional History Center is holding a viewing of the Pulse Memorial Crosses throughout the day today. I'm live in studio, Megan Myers, 10 Tampa Bay.